So I end up going to a haunted house. <laughs> it scared the shit out of me. And here's the shit to prove it. Said I can keep it. Like, I'm not going to act like I wanted to go in the first place. But when you got a woman, you got to go. I was screaming before I got into place. But not because there were scary people. It's just the prices were goddamn horrifying. Because for $53 for 30 minutes, like your job has been successfully done before I even got in that bitch. That will scare the hell out of any nigga. I was so scared I had to leave my woman by herself. Because shit gets real when you're scared. I didn't think I was going to be that scared. Why you say that? Because, motherfucker, I'm black in America, and there's nothing more scarier than that. And the costumes was phenomenal. I mean, they had TSA agents, FBI agents. They even had a white man dressed up like the IRS. When I seen that, I ran like hell. And everybody thought I was crazy. Because ain't nothing more scarier than a white person dressed up in a suit or in a uniform. Don't believe me? Ask OJ, MJ, or any nigga who knows David Stern. They even had Nixon and Ronald Reagan costumes. Like, I ran into a wall several times. Like white folks was jumping out of nowhere. And some of them tried to scare me with some random shit. Oh my god, oh my god. It's Tom Hanks making a castaway too. Run! It's the Jackson kids that didn't make it. Run! Oh, oh my god. It's precious in a bathing suit. <laughs> this one girl asked me, Do you want to be my new toy? I told that bitch additional parts sold separately. And she chased my ass. <laughs> and I'm kind of ashamed to say this. Because there was four of us, and three of us were screaming. And I ain't gonna act like I wasn't one of the niggas screaming. But I was so scared, I was grabbing on my nigga. Like, I had my dick on his ass, and I don't blame him if he punched me in the face. Shit, I would've done it. Guess sometimes your friends can be too loyal. Felt gay as shit. But I gotta admit, there was some racist ass actors. Like, they was trying to scare my ass with some random shit. There's no more Jordans at Foot Locker. There's no more Jordans at Foot Locker. <sighs> KFC is going out of business. KFC is going out of business. Well, I guess that is kind of scary to niggas. All in all, I thought it was worth my money. Until I got back to the gas tank and see my shit was almost on E. So thanks, whorehouse. And with that being said, I'm going to go check that footlocker.